Okay, I'm dealing with top heavy, and uh, I moved it as far back as it could. Um, if I move it any further up, and the deck locks will not stay in place. Um, good lord, how I'm gonna have to um get a head extender for I guess for both mounts now, I guess for. AVX and DX. Um, I got the idea from that guy named um, Rick, Rick, Rick the Van Man or something in the UK. He's got a channel of his personal hobbies and um, he had an extended head that um, he doesn't worry about his camera equipment banging the legs and shit. That's expensive camera back there, or if anything, uh, banging the legs of the tripod. Uh, there was another suggestion in having a talk with a guy named of a Chuck Astrophotography. He has a CGX mount, and um, he says he has locks in place. So it would be impossible for him if he ever decided to go, or if he ever had it along a you know, hardware like this, a telescope, I seriously doubt because he has locks. It will not bang into the uh, into the legs here of the tripod. Those for you, an AVX is a tripod. It has three legs. And um, I ordered uh, some more dew heater controllers. Uh, this is for a 10 inch. I got it wrapped around with uh, with painter's tape. I I trust painter's tape. It doesn't leave any sticky residue, so it's a very good best friend for anyone into this hobby, I believe. I'm using my GSO um, finder scope bracket here. See that? <laughs> all in the same place. Made in Taiwan, Chinese, whatever. All made in the same place. I think that was from uh, that movie uh, Armageddon where they're, they're trying to take off from the spaceship because the Russian guy said, don't touch nothing, don't touch nothing. Okay, back to, the, back to this. Um, yeah, the only problem I'm facing right now is uh, just worry about the, uh, about it, you know, banging into the legs. I know I can set filter limits within the hand controller, so it won't go at a certain horizon. So maybe from 90, I can limit it to like maybe 70 degree limit right there on filter limits, and I won't worry about banging my head. But still, when I'm doing um, SG Pro, I do not know if SG Pro will listen to the parameter set and the filter limits, so I worry about it, you know about Merid doing a Meridian flip. Well, let's just see how this goes and uh, I'll start working on getting it focused. Thanks for watching.